I'm Charles Kelly, and I'm the uh, project manager for the BC Construction Safety Alliance. Uh, today was uh, it was a great relief. This was uh, five years of hard work and uh, uh, bringing this together. We started with a blank slate, and uh, we've had to build this whole program from the bottom up, and it's very satisfying to get to the end of the day. Well, what's unique about it is that it's the first of its kind. You know that uh, because we've built this to an international standard, the highest standard that exists for uh, certifying the competency of persons. So, you know, that was a courageous and, and expensive investment by the BC Construction Safety Alliance. So that meant that we had to take it to uh, that highest standard, meant that, uh, you, know, you know, we need to be third party audited, that we are actually meeting those program requirements. What, once the program has been audited by ANSI, and it meets the uh, international standards requirements. It means that this certificate of competence is, uh, is, can be used anywhere in North America. It's portable, it stays with the operator, and the operator can move within the industry and, uh, and pursue their profession, a, a degree of professionalism that otherwise uh, wouldn't have been possible. W once a concrete pump operator has been certified competent, apart from their uh, uh, identification card, you know, they'll be getting one of these hard hats. And these uh, uh, ha hard hats will be a, a, a symbol uh, inside of a construction site to everyone there that this particular pump operator is certified as competent. Uh, so it's a, not only attractive, it's a, uh, it's a uh, symbol of achievement and the professionalism of the uh, pump operator that they've uh, reached this status.